there was this British reporter, this this kind of, you know, ran and chased me, stuck his TV camera in my face, and I'm walking out of the door, and, and at first he asked me about what we were seeing there, and I said, look, this is, this is horrific. This is, there are 19 sets of parents who are not going to be able to hug their child tonight or, or see their child, and it is, it's the most unspeakable evil we could imagine. He immediately jumped into, well, don't we need to pass gun control? And I didn't want to argue with this guy, and I'm disengaging. He's a British guy who's an obnoxious leftist, and he's like, why does this only happen in America? It doesn't happen anywhere else in the world. It's only America. Why is American exceptionalism so horrible? The premise of this question is, is factually false, and I actually, Newsweek, uh, just published something, which, which I'll point out. Um, I'm quoting from Newsweek um, that, that says, Since 1988, there have been a total of nine attacks similar to the Rob Elementary School shooting. Nine is nine too many. But once you adjust for population, there are many other countries, from Germany to Russia to Finland, that have comparable rates of school shootings. And in fact, it goes in and it breaks down uh, according to a Crime Prevention Research Center report from 2020, and this is a quote, the U.S. is well below the world average in terms of the number of mass public shootings, and the global increase over time has been much bigger than for the United States. And it goes on to say that, by our count, the U.S. makes up less than 1.13% of the mass public shooters, 1.77% of the murders, and 2.19% of their attacks. All of these are much less than the United States' 4.6% share of world population. And it goes on to say, again, this is a quote, out of the 101 countries where we have identified mass public shootings occurring, the United States ranks 66th in per capita frequency of these attacks and 56th in the murder rate. And on this issue in particular, the press is so wildly dishonest that I understand why people at home don't understand what to do about it. Most people at home don't know that, that there are laws we could pass that would stop felons and fugitives from illegally buying guns and put them in jail, but the Democrats are blocking them. Most people don't know that. Most people don't know that the Democrats have been blocking more funding for school safety for years. And the press will not report it. And, and that's why things like this podcast, I, I think that the press will tell us these horrific crimes occur only in America. That simply isn't true. The data show, according to the Crime Prevention Research Center, quote, out of the 101 countries where we have identified mass public shootings occurring, the United States ranks 66th in the per capita frequency of these attacks and 56th in the murder rate. But to be clear, one is one too many.